Hey guys, well, it's time to get another fourth weapon, so let's do it. Alright, so in the last part, we got Sal Sal's fourth weapon. This time around, we're going to get Zhou Yu's fourth weapon. In order to do that, you have to go to the Battle of Cherby, play under Sun Chuan's forces, and play as Zhou Yu. Alright, let's do it. So, I mean, we've done this level before with one guy to get his fourth weapon. Um, similar, it's not going to be as hard as I, you know, we've done it before, so. Anyway, uh, the intro and the conditions we know, the equipment, the weapon, we have an Elder Sword. With a Musu charge of 5, HP max of 26, and a mounted attack of 10. The items will keep the same 5 as always, so there we go. The bodyguards we're going to keep at 8. Alright, let's do it. Send a unit to stop the way invasion! Protect the place of prayers as well! Hold out for the southeast winds! Then the battle is ours! Alright, so the fourth weapon conditions, it's really not that difficult. All you really need to do is do one of the following. Either defeat Zha Ho Dun and Zhang He, or defeat Zha Ho Dun and Shu Huang. So you have to pick your poison, so to speak. So um, we're going to go and defeat Zha Ho Dun and Zhang He for the fourth weapon. I mean, it's a... Yeah, it doesn't really matter what you do. I mean, you'll get the fourth weapon no matter what happens, but... Anyway, first Jaho Dune. Yikes. Yeah, let's finish him off. Uh, that's one down. They look strong. Be brave. All right, now we'll go for Zhang He. Don't fall behind. We'll just take care of what's left on the left side. Wow. Um. Yeah, so we'll go for that, then... Then we'll go for Sal P. Yeah, mind that. There we go. Sometimes that will do that if you keep on pausing it at the wrong spots. Well, for me anyway. Uh, so now we're going to go and defeat uh, Sal Ren and Yu Jin. Which are Zhang He's sub-generals. Every now and then it will be Zhao Yuan instead of Zhang He over here. It's very rare for me to see Zhang He on the left side. Alright, he needs to quit shielding. There we go. Alright, let's get this, you know, let's get rid of this rat pack. There we go. One, pretty much one attack, well, not one attack, but, you know. That's what I like about Zhou Yu's running attack. He'll attack multiple times.
All right, so who's over here? Zhang He. Okay. This battlefield will be your last. So let's just go straight to defeat Zhang He here. I don't have to worry about Sal Ren. Yikes. That was a cheap shot. The enemy general has fallen to my blade. Death can be a beautiful thing. All units, cover one guy. All right, there we go. Now that we defeated both Zhang He and Zha Hodun, the fourth weapon appeared. Now we're gonna go to the far right and defeat. Uh... You fight like the devil. Yeah, we're gonna go and defeat Shu Huang. I'm not worried about Sao Pi at the moment. It's more of making sure that Tai Shu Se doesn't get killed. Because if you focus on one side on hard mode, well, I've actually gone and I grabbed the fourth weapon. Well, in the past I've done it, and I remember very well that if we, well, if I go on one side and take care of everyone on one side, then the other general it'll either be Lu Meng or Tai Shi Se. The other will get defeated very quickly and the one on the left side is more rapid because Zhang He's uh, morale was extremely high there it was at 6 and Xu Huang's is at 5 by default but now it's gonna go up it's probably at 6 or 7 right now it's at 6 right now so we'll go and defeat him then go for Sao Pi and for me personally, I don't have to worry about the fire attack. I can win without that fire attack. It's just, uh... It does it by itself, so, you know... I can't really put aid to it. I could leave Jaho Dun alive, but... At the end of the day, he needs to be defeated. And I'm trying to get it done quickly. So, yeah. Anyway... We're pretty much here. So now we're gonna go for one pin. And Cao Zhang. Yeah, don't even try that. Alright, that's one down. That's two down. Now Shu Huang. And there's the third. Is this it? Does it all end here? We must reach 
triumphant. Whoa, where? All right, let's take care of this rat pack. Yeah, for people who's new to watching these videos, when I say Rat Pack, I mean the archers. Because they are they run away like little rats. That's just my personal opinion. Because when they attack, they scatter. But they don't just scatter, they separate. And, yeah. And for me personally, out of all the archers in Dynasty Warriors, this has to be the worst ones, in my opinion. I mean, every time you get hit, it's almost like a slap in the face, kind of. Meanwhile, when I play 4 or 5, it's like, yeah, let's just get rid of them. Here, it's like, wow, they're really, really starting to bug me. We need to take care of them now. Alright, so now we're going to go, and that was really strange. Did it really just say I... It did, yeah. Apparently I got 100 even though it showed I got 99 KOs. Alright, Yui Jin's next. And you're not going to send me flying. I mean, this level in general I'm not really concerned about. I mean, if I have to say anything that would be a challenge would probably be the commander, but that's just not an issue. I mean, if you have the way of Musu, you'll be fine. The enemy has fallen to my blade. It won't matter who you face. The way of Musu will help tremendously. We must be triumphant. Alright, so now we're going to go for Sal P and Lee Dian. Then we'll have the last three. Uh, Zhang Liao, Sal Xiu, and uh, Sal Sal. Also, reinforcements will appear. But uh, if I don't run into Shun Yu, I'm not going to face him. But if I do, I'll face him. It's just... Uh, if I'm facing Sal Sal and Shun Yu is not in my area when he appears. Why would I go out my way to go for him? I mean at the end of the day, we're trying to get fourth weapons, but if I have, if I if I decide to defeat all the generals, I'll do it. And I'll pretty much do that every time if I have to. The only times I won't is if I'm nearly well, if the commander's nearly dead. Alright, so now we're almost there. It's just one little part that gets a little puzzling sometimes. Alright, there's Lee Dien. Alright, that should finish him off. Alright, now Sal P. Fortunately, they're both right next to each other. So now, there we go. Don't even try it. Yikes. I mean, I'm not scared of an AI, it's just the shielding part kind of gets annoying. To 
Really? Alright, now let's get out of here and we'll face Zhang Liao next. Simply because if he's alive at a certain time, he will kill well Technically not kill, but he'll defeat Huang Gai through a cutscene. I've shown it off twice. Um Yeah, he'll show well He'll defend Cao Cao by shooting Huang Gai with an arrow. Uh Zhou Yu's Musumo definitely I remember having that that being shown. And I think soon Jian as well. Yeah, so if you want to see that cutscene, uh, go to Zhou Yu's Musa mode of this part. Or soon Jian's, if I'm not mistaken, or soon Jian. Alright, the jungle Liao's down. I have found my place of rest. Farewell. The enemy general has fallen to my blade. Now we'll go for Sao Shiyu. Don't fall behind. You know what? We could go on foot here because uh the only person that's left after that is Sao Sao. Reinforcements. Press the attack. Well, never mind, Shunyu has appeared, but if he's there. Yeah, if he approaches me before I get to Sao Sao, then I'll go after him and defeat him. But I'm not going to try if I, you know, if he's far in my reach. And he really just shielded up through every single Musu attack. Great. Just great. Yeah, try shielding that. Alright, so now we're gonna go in the fate uh We're gonna go in the feet Sao Sao. I mean if you saw me breaking that box with that weapon, that's the fourth weapon right there. Yeah, Shunyu is all the way up there, so I'm not going to even bother going for him. You know what, let's just go around. I know Sao Hong's over there, as well as Sao Sao. Yeah, don't even try it. He's one hit away from getting killed. Well, that did it. Well, looks like I'm going to have to kill everyone in sight now. I know there's a couple of rat packs over here because I've been getting hit with arrows. Like 
Hey, you see all those arrows that they try to shoot at me? I can only imagine if all of them hit me. Alright, now this pack first. Alright, quit shooting. Okay, now where are more rat packs? You know what? That might be all of them. I was wrong. It looked like they were shooting from multiple directions, though. Anyway, let's face Sao Sao and finish this off. I will show you the path to the spirit world. Yikes! Kind of got a little trigger happy there. Yikes, you know what? I'll just let him attack me. Alright, this should leave a mark. I don't think I'm gonna kill him. Nope. Now I will. And that's a win. Alright, so that's 20 down. And another 21 more to go. Well, 3 kingdoms and 12. Alright, let's see how long that actually took. 16 minutes and 51 seconds. Alright. Not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, so that's that. Eh. Okay. Here's the fourth weapon. The, H the Ancient Sword. Uh, has an element of fire, attack of 20, well, additional attack of 23, I should say, because the attack normally is 46. Anyway, defense of 50, reach of 25, moves to charge of 27. So, pretty good fourth weapon, for me, well, in my opinion. Uh, yeah. Alright, items. Uh, I was going to say, it would be kind of nice if I could max out that uh, wind scroll right here and there, but... Eh, you can't get them all, huh? Alright, who cares about the points? We'll save. And there you have it. You've been watching my gaming adventures, and I'll see you for the next part, which will be Wang Zhang's fourth weapon. Peace.